Hi everybody, guess what? I am back with Amara of David Weekly Homes. You guys know Amara, and she's got another preserve lot here in Settler's Landing, but there's more Amara. You said this is it, the this last it. opportunity. This is the very last one in Settler's Landing with David Weekly Homes. I mean, I can't believe it. I'm so excited. We're finally at that point. So Amara's gonna show you your next house. So let's go inside. Great, thanks for having us here today. Welcome to 154 Rainbow Trout Lane. This is our ever so popular Elsner floor plan. It boasts four bedrooms and two and a half full bathrooms, just under 2,300 square feet. It actually feels bigger than that, and I believe it's because of this grand foyer that we're walking into in the second floor, how it's all open. It does feel bigger than that square footage. What Carly's showing, of course, is the powder room, so when you do have guests coming, I like that you have a place for them to go. Perfect. But you guys know, this is something David Weekly's been putting in these quick move-ins, the Harry Potter space. Yes, we love this space and it seems to go on for days. <laughs> Included is a light and a clothing rack so you can use it for your storage, as a coat closet, or as a playroom for the kids. <laughs> I love that, I love that. So let's keep going in. Also look to the left, Carling because this is where the two-car garage is and the drop zone, but Amara's got something to say besides the two-car garage. In addition to the two-car garage, we have an additional three-foot storage space that has a water softener loop for a water softener system. It's a great space for your tools or any extra outdoor storage. And that's important to point out. So when you do give her a call and you come and see this quick move in, having that extra storage is gonna be key. So this kitchen, I'm loving the colors that y'all have done. And Amara, are these soft closed drawers? Yes, this is one our gourmet kitchen, Heather. So just one of the features of this kitchen are these fabulous dovetail constructed soft closed drawers in this beautiful soft gray color. Not to mention, this kitchen has countertop space four days. It really does. And I'm going ahead and opening the pantry because I like that you can even step into it. There's plenty of room to even go higher. David Weekly Homes just put in a handful of racks. You can really make it your own with this space. And then I want to remind people in Settlers Landing, this is a gas community. So you've got your five burner gas range, which is just perfect. You also have your wall oven and microwave. This is great for those holidays or when you're entertaining to have this beautiful gourmet kitchen. It's also open to the living room space. So if you're like me and you like to cook and watch TV at the same time, this is the kitchen for you. And look at the view. This is the beautiful thing about these David Weekly homes that they've all been placed on preserves. That's something so many residents love. And then you'll see as we get closer that we've got the collapsible doors. Amara's gonna show that. So great for entertaining. Yes, and this home site sits just doors away from the cul-de-sac. You've got a fabulous extended line. And see how they collapse, which I love. So that's the great thing is that again, that indoor outdoor entertaining and we've got the recess lights throughout the house, even here in the covered lanai, which I love. And what's great for hot days like this is that these are actually pre-wired for a ceiling fan or a light fixture. So it's already set up for you to create your outdoor entertainment space. And correct me if I'm wrong, they can have a fence in here if they choose to. Absolutely, you can fence in this gorgeous home site. It's a really deep home site, by the it way. Is. I love how deep this is. And again, the view is just spectacular. And I like that Amara pointed out, we literally are just a door away from the cul-de-sac. So if you do have young family moving in here, that's a great place for the little kids to learn to ride their bicycles. So just going in that cul-de-sac. Also a big selling point to this location within Settler's Landing. And again, Amara, say the address one more time. This is 154 Rainbow Trout Lane. So that address and this road literally is down the street from Settler's Pond. 
Why is that important? I know we talk about Settlers Pond a lot and we do have a video on Nocatee.com, but Settlers Pond is, has a playground, has a dog park. It has my favorite thing, a 14 acre stocked fishing pond. So, so many neighborhoods, they don't want you to fish in the HOA ponds. Well, guess what everyone? You have a pond that is just so much fun that you can fish in. You can also kayak and canoe in it. But even bigger than that, if you do have a kindergartner through eighth grade student, guess what? You can ride your bike to Pine Island Academy or heck, you can golf cart because right Amara, this is a golf cart community. It is a golf cart community. All of the roadways have sidewalks that accommodate it and our amenities have special golf cart parking as well. Love it. So now we came up to the second floor and how many bedrooms are on the second floor? So this is a three bedroom plan. Something that we have going on right now um, for our incentives for this plan is that we have $25,000 in flex cash, Heather. Okay, that's a lot. So when Amara said three bedrooms, she didn't mean total. She was meaning that all the secondary bedrooms. There's three of those. And then of course, when you see the primary bedroom, that's gonna knock your socks it off. It is gonna knock your so socks off. It's in a category all its own. So again, we've got a bathroom. Okay, now the laundry room, everyone knows I love a laundry room, so we got to show the laundry room. This is like its own room. It's huge. Wow. And I do like the built-ins and that y'all have done that. And I love the folding station, which is gonna be against the opposite wall to fold all the laundry. <laughs> How often do you need that space in the laundry room? I know that's something that I wish I had more often. And you know what's nice? It's right outside of all the bedrooms, so I'm going to expect everyone to throw their clothes in that space. <laughs> I expect no dirty clothes that's on right. the floor. But now we have to go into this giant, giant primary bedroom. I mean, it is huge. Wow. And look at your view outside. I mean, you could really have like 10 beds in here. You could. This, <laughs> this will fit your bedroom space. You can do a book reading corner. Absolutely. It's definitely an oasis for sure. Absolutely. And this floor plan, can we remind everybody of the floor plan? Yes, this is our Elsner floor plan. Again, it's a four bedroom, two and a half bath plan, just under 2,300 square feet. And we're not going to say the price, but Amara actually shared with Carly and I the price. It is priced so well. So I can't wait for you to give her a call and find out, okay, what's going on? What can you do for me? Because it's going to be amazing. And I'm excited to see the family that moves into this particular home. So what Carling's showing, of course, is the beautiful full bath. This, and this is one of our oh, David nice. Weekly signatures here is our extended owner's retreat shower. Oh, yeah. It's got an additional shower head as well, and our personal designers have picked the most beautiful coastal tile to go in it. And then you know, did you do the luggage rack? Tell me you did the luggage rack. Oh, the here it is, rack. the luggage rack, the David Weekly luggage rack. Yes, it's actually framed into the wall, so it's extra secure for any heavy storage. That's just something we've loved through the years, and we're always like, do you have the luggage rack? Yes, we always have the luggage rack. Very when large closet. I got the luggage rack. Oh my gosh. So and I that was Lennon's store bathroom? Yeah, absolutely. So, Lennon, yes. We just don't have... Carling, this is such a big house. We can't show everything. Because we want the buyer to come in here, call Amara. You've got to see the house. But this floor plan, everyone, just remind you, is the last opportunity to live in Sedler's Landing in a David Weekly home. That is huge. I am so excited for this community to be sold out for you guys to sell out. So guess what guys? Thanks for always watching Walkthrough Wednesday. I'm with Amara, David Weekly Homes, and we can't wait to sell you that house today. Bye Thanks. guys. Bye guys. Bye.